Hello everybody, good morning! Uh, we're going to do the Friday workout. It's almost weekend. Get ready for it. I have good news for you. Today is not such a heavy workout. It's actually quite doable. Yesterday was way much more intense. So I wish you good luck and you don't really need it. Today we're going to do a chest press. I'm doing it off the floor. Usually when we're in the gym we do a chest press from a bench and why we do this is because we create height and that's why we can pull down the elbows lower. This creates a larger range of motion. Of course at home it's hard, you may, might have a couch or something, but it usually is wider than we are and you want it to be slightly wider but not too wide, otherwise the elbows go too far out and you want it to keep it a little bit close to your body. So we'll do it today off the floor. Um, what you get a little bit is that uh, you might need a little more weight to make it more intense or more reps. So I want you to listen to your body, make sure it's, it's challenging. If it's not challenging, nothing happens. It's just a waste of time. Our second exercise is a side bend for the external oblique muscles for the core. And our third one is a straddle run. I know some of you cannot jump. I will help you with it. So we start laying down. That sounds really nice. So some people like to lay like this uh, in order to keep the lower back pressing to the mat. I always keep my feet on the mat. It doesn't matter at all. Whatever is preferable for you. So I want you to keep your hands near your chest, not near your face. This is not the best. And now all I'm going to do is chest press up. And as you can see maybe, I'm pressing my hands close together. Two. Elbows out as low as you can. Three. Pull it down. Just to make sure, I'm going to pull it in a little bit. So really keep active at the neck. I'm squeezing my glutes and I'm going to make a side bend. One. It's all about extending the waist of my left side. Three. So you see sometimes people start to move the legs. Please do not do that. Four. And five. So I'm holding my belly. I'm squeezing in. Six. And if you, if you don't feel it here, you need to go down lower. And eight. around the waist, 10, keep squeezing the glutes, 11, and 12, 13, 14, 15, don't stop, and 16, 17, 18, I'm almost there, 19, and 20, perfect, that was enough, and now I'm making a straddle run, so what I want you to do is run open the I'm not on a flat surface, so that makes me maybe fall over easily. So be gentle wherever you are. If you cannot run, just sit down low and open those legs and keep the booty down. Don't lift up the shoulders. So if you like, you can really make it like this. So all about opening and closing. Get ready, let's go for 20, 19, 18, pull up the knees, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, don't stop. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. So, 
if you're not really out of breath and it's not challenging, make sure you do like 30 or 40. That's fine. All good. So, what I'm going to do now is lay down for my second round. Here I go for my chest press. So, each time you push your arms up, pressing the chest up might help. And you don't really see it, it's a very small movement. Let's go for one, and two. Exhale, three. Ten more. Ten. Come on, guys. Nine. Eight. So you might feel the right arm is a little bit stronger. Please make it equal. Five and four. Three and two and one. Perfect. All right. I'm standing up and I'm taking my weight in my left hand. So open the legs. Tilt your shoulder backwards, pull in the abs, and let's go one. So if you don't feel this one, it can have two causes. Either you're not going down to low enough, so you can choose to go a little bit lower, or there's not enough extension on the waist, and in order to make it more extended, you can put your hand on your temples, your fingertips. So this will make it more intense. Choose whichever you like. Okay, let's go for 12. 11, 10, squeeze it in, 9, and 8, 7, hold your belly, pull it up, 6, and 5, and 4, and 3, don't stop, I feel it now, 2, and 1. Now, for some reason, I always feel it better in my right side, I don't know why that is, we're all a li the little bit lopsided, some people have one leg a little longer than the other. So let's go with links. Left leg, two, open, three, four. So you can choose not to jump. Six, seven, pull up, eight, nine, ten, come on, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, you're almost there, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yeah, perfect. So, I'm down to round number three. I'm going to lay down on my neck. And it looks very challenging. So, if I would have five kilo weights, it would be a lot more challenging. But I don't have those, so I might do five rounds today. Just one extra for myself. All right, pull in the abs. And one. And two. Keep going. Three. Exhale and push. Four, now pull down, five, active core, six, the hands are in a straight line over the chest, seven, eight, pull down, nine, so you can imagine if you would pull down lower, and ten, and nine, and eight, and seven, and six, you're almost there, five, Just two more rounds to go, we're almost there. Let's go, one, yes, two, extending, three, freeze the legs. Some people like to bend the knees, but this invites the legs to move, so it's not good, four, and five. So if you squeeze your free hand in your waist, what do you feel on your hand? You feel something getting a little bit harder under your skin, now, that is your external as we call the waist muscle and it's really nice to make it a little tighter I like it so I do a lot of exercises for that myself 13 almost 14 <laughs> I lost count there 15 16 so it's really important I feel it and 18 19 20 so if I don't feel it enough I can also choose to keep it little bit down, pulsing it, keep shoulders low, or 
put your fingers on your temples. All right, get ready for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now I'm doing left, so I do uh, right later. <laughs> 11, 12, 13, 14, come on, 15, pick up your pair, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Last round, I love that. Some of the programs are harder than the other ones. And this is a nice gentle one. It can be nice for a change. And it's over before you know it. One, two, hold on. Three. Look at your wrist. Are they straight? Four. And five. Don't stop. And six. And a seven. facing away from your face, 17, 18, 19, 20, beep beep, all right, so stand up and open the chest, last one, one, two, three, four, straight legs, squeezing butt cheeks, so you see, I'm not doing this, I'm squeezing forward. Six, seven, eight, squeeze in your tummy, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So now it's my final exercise. Let's go. One. Two, three, so you feel a difference in the legs. Eh? Five, five, six. My right leg always wants to do a little bit extra. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Come on, speed up. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. I'm finished. Now, look at this plant over here. I don't know if you can see it. I had some friends visiting. They told me it's sick. It has some bug in it, so I might cut it down. I don't know. I'm gonna look for a solution. Just saying, just making conversation. Have a lovely day. Enjoy.